this video will present a proof that for n greater than or equal to 2, the order of the alternating group with n letters, a sub n, is equal to n factorial over 2. Recall that s sub n, the symmetric group on n letters, has n factorial elements. For example, s sub 3 has 3 factorial equal to 3 times 2 times 1 equal to 6 elements, namely the permutation are E, 2 cycle 1, 2, 2 cycle 1, 3, 2 cycle 2, 3, and 3 cycle 1, 2, 3, and 3 cycle 1, 3, 2. These are the 6 elements in S sub 3. In S sub n, some permutations are even. For example, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 3, 4 are even permutation. These are permutations which can be expressed as product of even number of transportation, that is 2 cycle. Similarly, in S sub n, some permutations are odd. For example, the 2 cycle 1, 2 and 3, 4, 5, 6, 3, 4 are odd permutations. These are permutations which can be written as a product of odd number of transportation. What is A sub n? This is the set of all even permutation. We call A sub n the alternating group on n letters. Now the claim is for n greater than equal to A sub n has n factorial over 2 elements. To start with the proof, I let B sub n be the set of all odd permutations in Sn. And I define a mapping lambda from A sub n to B sub n given by for every even permutation sigma in A sub n, I define the image of sigma under lambda is equal to 1, 2 times sigma. Then we know 1, 2 times sigma is an element in B sub n, since sigma can be written as a product of even number of transposition. So together with 1, 2 in front, 1, 2 times sigma will be in B n. That is, 1, 2 times sigma is a odd permutation. Now we will show that this lambda is 1 to 1. If sigma 1 and sigma 2 are even permutation, and suppose the image of sigma 1 and sigma 2 are equal, that means 1 2 times sigma 1 is equal to 1 2 times sigma 2. If we multiply both sides on the left by 1 2 again, then 1 2 1 2 sigma 1 is equal to 1 2 1 2 sigma 2. But since 1, 2 times 1, 2 is identity E, therefore we will have, we have sigma 1 equal to sigma 2. And this proves that lambda is 1 to 1. Next, we will show that the mapping lambda is on to. Let tau be an element in Bn. That means tau can be expressed as a product of odd number of transposition. Observe that if you multiply tau on the left by 1, 2, then 1, 2 times tau is an even permutation. Now what is the image of 1, 2 times tau and the lambda? By the definition of lambda, this is equal to 1, 2 
times 1, 2 times tau. But then, 1, 2 times 1, 2 is the identity element. And the identity element times tau is equal to tau. This means that the mapping lambda is onto. Therefore, we have shown that lambda is 1 to 1 and onto from the set of event permutation to the set of op permutation. Therefore, the order of an and the order of bn is the same. Since the union of an and bn is s sub n, and an and bn are destroyed, and the order of sn is n factorial, therefore, the order of a sub n is n factorial over 2. And that finished the proof.